there's a lot of surprises in life, such as the Batman movie getting an official title, Godzilla's gonna fight King Kong, the Wonder Woman trailer, and stuff like that, and Fox not wanting to get the rights to Marvel of Fantastic Four. But this is definitely one. Ip Man 4. I really didn't see this one coming, but let's read some of the things that the article is saying, which of course will be linked in the description down below, and let's talk about it. So this is what they're saying. The star Donnie Yen recently announced that he is indeed planning on returning for Ip Man 4 after a very successful third entry was released earlier this year of 2016. The modern day martial arts legend took to his Instagram to make the announcement that Ip Man 4 is happening. While there was a pretty significant gap of nearly 5 years between the release of Ip Man 2 Legend of Grandmaster and Ip Man 3, it seems like Donnie Yen is wasting no time in getting Ip Man 4 off the ground. Here's what he had to say about the movie on his Instagram post. I want to share this very exciting news with you all. My good friend uh, Wilson Yip, who, has, who had directed all my last 3 Ip Man series tonight, we have decided to reunite and continue to make our next project together, Ip Man 4. Yes, Ip Man Part 4. Yeah, okay. So that was the quote from Donnie Yen. Uh, apparently, he announced this on Instagram. And uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Get Goodbye. No, seriously. <laughs> I'm sorry. Turns out that not only is Donnie Yen returning, but it looks like the director, who is also the writer, I think, uh, will be returning for the fourth time, so I don't know what you guys think about the Ip Man movies, but if you have not seen the Ip Man movies and you like action, especially if you are into or interested in martial arts, you know, I would definitely recommend you guys to see these movies. Now, the first movie is great. Like, I love that movie. It's actually a great film. Like, th the action is really cool, it's over the top, but it's supposed to be over the top, but the story is actually surprisingly really deep. I thought it was just gonna be some sort of a cookie cutter uh, action movie, but the first movie is kind of serious and it works. The second movie is, it's still serious, but it gets a little bit more fun than the first one. Uh, probably because they're not really at war in the first movie there are during at war So the second movie is a lot of fun. I don't love it, but it's a lot of fun though The third one I saw recently. I was kind of let down with the third one. I liked it, but I'm not probably gonna see it again uh, I don't know like I thoroughly enjoyed it But it got a little bit too comedic relief and such and it got a little bit too cliche and such You know, I'm not gonna review the whole movie, but Honestly, the franchise got a little bit like slower and slower, but surely worse. But, you know, me saying worse is kind of the wrong word because they're not bad movies. It's just that, I don't know, like after the first one, how can you top that? You know what I mean? So if they want to make a fourth one, I would say go ahead. But please, please take into an evaluation of what people did not like about the third one. I mean, it was probably successful during the box office and, and critics and all that, but... You know, I'm sure everyone still says the first one, or the second one for that matter, is the best one. And they have the reasons for that. I don't know, focus more on story. Because that, that was definitely what the third movie was lacking in my personal opinion. Was that the third one was lacking a little bit on story. It was like, here's another story. Oh, here's another story. And here's another sub-story. Oh yeah, and now action. And then movie's over. And it's kind of like, you know, come on. Finish up what you started, you know what I mean? Like, that's what the first and the second movie did so nicely. It was just tying up all into this one little bow. It made it simple, but it made it very great at the same time. Like, it's really hard to explain, but again, I'm trying to, not to review the movie, but I'm just trying to say my personal opinion about this. So, uh, yeah, Do uh, Donnie Yen is returning for an Ip Man 4. Uh, there's no release date yet or anything like that. I'm sure that Donnie Yen is going to be announcing that soon or, or or something like that I, I guess but so let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below what do you guys think about this what did you guys think about the previous Ip Man movies which one is your favorite have you ever seen any of the movies uh, try not to spoil anything in the movies for anyone who hasn't seen the movies yet in the comment section down below if you're gonna talk spoilers I guess have some spoiler tag are you excited for Ip Man 4 all right thank you guys so much for watching guys don't forget to leave a rating don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're new here for more content like this and uh, yeah take care